Hello lovely people bless you for coming another update on our board and this one is all about a video circulating on the media top that has generated a whole lot of reaction so in this video a hair vendor shows how she gets her human hair real human hair so this lady all goes all the way to vietnam the villages and those countries the villages and go search for women with long hair so she pays them 250 dollars and these women will cut their hair for her so that she will come out and sell them to her customers and this has got a lot of people talking say what are tall women they look for in this world because these these women will shave their eyebrow and draw pencil they will do their nyash they will do plenty of things that when you, when you think of her you say nah women they do too much then they do too much for this world inside i'm not saying all of them but telling most of them they do them they do too much because why they'll be crying over and also be obsessed about this human hair and charlie they could be billing their boys then my boyfriend buy me brazilian hair buy me indian hair not knowing where this hair them they come from bro i have the video here let's go and watch the video when we're back i will take you through some of the reactions that is coming in so we're not supposed to there so this was me just walking around to see how everywhere is and then the women the, the women started to arrive one after the other because of course they were already told so it was me talking to them first like i said we ethically source our raw donor hair so i was talking to them checking out the hair before we started the cutting process so yeah Everybody, all of them are happy to cut. Nobody is being forced to do anything. They willingly come to give it to um, give you give you their hair to buy. Um, you give them exchange for money. We try as much as possible not to negotiate. This was the second or third woman, and then it just went on and on. Kept cutting and paying. We tried as much as possible any amount that they asked for. So each person we give two hundred and fifty dollars, even though some of their hair was not even up to hundred. Um, gram not even up to 70 gram by the way this was the first woman living and she was all smile see how it had bob short bob hair now he actually looked good on her yeah so yeah at some point um i just kept cutting this was the next person it just went on and on and on you know we could do this all day this was another woman and you know each time we get it we just hand them their hair back after cutting it we hand them their hair back and then we go ahead Go ahead to collect it back from them when we give them money then this was the next person you can see before we started to call then so i started to cry and i took a break washed my hands very well went back into the car to breastfeed because oh she was screaming you people you know zaha she wants to cry you hear her voice everywhere after breastfeeding i came back to my cutting and i continued and continued and this girl she was so pretty i really loved her hair but she said oh she's not ready that the next time i come she'll be ready so i thought i know well and now since no one gave me then finally you know these kids they were really supportive they've been with me since morning that i arrived so of course i had to do something for the streets so i had to give them something for the road may they use this one take hold body right so yeah, not this small dollar we spend here today because we don't negotiate with the donors, you know. You can't, you don't want to negotiate with them in a process like that. Yeah, so that'll be the video for you. And as I said earlier, this video has got a lot of people talking on the media top like crazy because, you know, they make sense. How you could go buy someone's hair and come put on your own. You guys know that I appreciate anything where God gave you. What else here? $250 i don't think so because these vietnam people if they change that 250 dollars it's going to be plenty of money so i'm not sure this lady paid them that 250 dollars that she did talk about because how for all you know nona she will be paying them like less than 50 dollars and they are so happy to do it what you see these people will come out and sell this hair at like higher rate 
and girls will be obsessed with these kind of hairs and chalet they will be disturbing them my boyfriends them my husbands to go get these hairs for them what did i say so let's go through some of the reaction that is coming in yostulu african females buying hair of others other races will never sit well with me no matter how you want to paint it is the lowest form of self-hate because you know they make sense women they do too much as well bro okay so this person also said not hair wearing their hairs to go and collect their hairs <laughs> okay so to the next one mr wick i say till african women start appreciating their own natural hair i will never rate hair extensions and wigs no matter how expensive why do you all even need these extensions though why can't you just grow your hair long too how i would the add person hair to my own that person in head that person in head they grow so why don't you appreciate your own grow your own we have a lot of ladies out there beautiful ladies out there who are doing natural and it is still them Mwah. bro we have ladies who have shaved their hair off and they are looking beautiful Mwah. so be yourself accept who you are what do you see rather than Charlie buying all these expensive hair and you don't know where they are coming from buying Indian hair you don't know where they are coming from I heard Indians they they use their hair to do sacrifice and people will go and buy them and come sell to people what they say which you know they make sense for we know you'll be inheriting people them are spiritual problems and stuff let's move on to the next one nigerian women craving for the discarded hair of foreign women will never make sense to me okay so someone is talking about the money that the lady said she paid to them 250 dollars care do people actually believe what she said in the audio she added to the video not surprising that black women are easily exploited and buying wigs when buying wigs these hair are gotten incredibly cheap from vietnam as i said there's no way she's going to pay 250 dollars for these hair nah she's just saying it so that people that will come out and buy these hairs will also like pay more because you cannot say i am i am i am paying for 250 dollars and you're going to pay for less nah no way so i cannot come out and say that nah, i gave them 10 cds i gave them like five dollars i gave them ten dollars to buy this hair so that people will see that oh i got this hair cheap so they will come out and also buy it cheap no probably she's going to raise the price so that it will make it seems she got it expensive i'll say see her with her short bob hair she looks beautiful teeth i'll say see her with her short bob hair she looks beautiful you they come teeth them he says she looks beautiful hmm? okay nigerian women good thing say you want to use i'm go do ritual because you cannot do this in africa go to someone charlie cut your hair for me make a go sell the person good thing say you go use them to do rituals or go use them to do juju because you know they make sense this one too said you will never understand women that one dear you will never understand women don't even bother to try they shave their eyebrow to draw pencil <laughs> they cut another person's hair just to put it on their own head my brother don't bother yourself you will never understand them you will never they go do nash you will never understand women they fix their eye lashes you will never understand them they shave their eyebrow, draw pencil. You will never understand them. Bro, plenty of things you will never understand women. What I say? I say, in as much as no one is being forced to trade their hair, this video screams exploitation. I refuse to believe that the vendor actually paid each seller $250, judging by how naive they seem and the location. But that's not all. The money being gifted to those cases looks like looks like tactics to appear thoughtful and kind okay so let's move on to the next one midex said now so people they inherit 
others' ancestral or spiritual problem. It be true because we don't know where these human hair they are coming from, and girls will be obsessed with it. So why can't you all appreciate what God gave you? I actually thought these ways were synthetic. Buying other women's hair should be abolished. Okay, Odogu Anyoma said, What's the essence of this hair extension? Imagine the people selling and what is to them. So pastor's wife fit wear pagan human hair. Pagan human hair. So this is what our ladies wear. Wearing someone's else else hair no wonder they can borrow from each other just to appear different at different occasions okay so uh someone also said chai now original hair be this so mm -hmm. obviously now original hair be this so so Charlie, plenty plenty of reaction if i say i go talk all of them here now we no go go today what did i say we no go go today because it's scary what did i say and it'd be surprising how on our ladies these days don't appreciate anything that God gave them. Some people, they look beautiful, but they prefer to add makeup. They even look beautiful when there is no makeup than when they apply makeup. But still, you will see them wearing makeup left, right, center, 24-7. As I already say, guys or men are not expecting so much from women just be decent just be decent bro just be decent simple things fee attract men simple simple things fee attract men it no be your makeup it no be your 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 eyelashes extension it no be your hair extension it no be that much it no be that though it be simple simple things with attract men so on our ladies Things where you f you guys think say you they do we go fit attract men. No? It no be that. It no be that we attract men. It be simple, simple, simple things we attract men. So you guys, for stop this. Appreciate your own. Be proud of yourself. Build upon your own natural hair. So Charlie, that be the update for you. Don't forget to leave your comment below in the comment section as well. My name is Andy. Bless you for passing through. I'm out for the day. Bye-bye. Hi, everyone. I'm Kafui Akutu Sandra. Are you looking for entertainment or any trending news? Wait, let me recommend Wikimix Media. Go there, subscribe, and like the channel. I know you're going to like it. Thank you. Bye-bye. Hello. Odame Berima once again. Are you a fan of entertainment? You care to know about what is going on around the world? Then let Weakness Media be your friend. Subscribe to the channel, hit on the notification bell, and please, when you like the videos, share it for me. Thank you.